you something that's been on my mind for a bit of time now. Is Rock Smasher a villain song? In the context of the series known as Starter Squad on the Shippage YouTube channel, which is basically a story about, well, for the first nine episodes, it was about the three Kanto starters, then Turtwig and Chimchar were involved in episode 10. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna say, spoiler warning. So, Rock Smasher happened in episode 9, where Dirtle, aka Sandshrew, and Charmander went down to the Caterpie's uh, hideaway with the help of Mewtwo to go and rescue Squirtle because he got kidnapped. And uh, one, uh, one at Butterfree, which belonged to the Caterpie clan, sent out some Pokemon to try to stop them. There was a Beedrill who was just overjoyed to see the outside world again and died. And then Geodude, which is the important one for this. <sighs> what happened is it basically it was sent out, told not to kill him. It tries to anyways. And, uh, hence, Rock Smasher. And if you've seen the series, you'd probably think, this is pretty obvious, of course it's a villain song. Well, think about it in the context of the story. I mean, sure, the Caterpies are in the wrong for kidnapping Squirtle, but what else did they really do that was wrong? Think about it. In the context of the story, it all started wh when uh, the three of them, um, when the trio Bulbasaur, Charmander, and Squirtle were going along. They see a Caterpie, and, Char and Charmander murders it for no real reason. Then the entire Caterpie clan is mad at them, and it tries to attack them to get revenge, and they just keep on slaughtering them. And uh, another important place to look is the lyrics. Such as slaughtering, uh, slaughter, uh, wait, this is slaughtering all that are smaller and too weak to resist. Also, of course, hundreds of innocent, hundreds of innocents slaughtered, most in their physical crime. You killed them, you ravaged their homelands. Now you will pay for your crimes. So, in this, even though the Geodude was probably just like a suit of theirs, they know what Charmander did. They killed them for no real reason. I mean, sure, they what they did to try to get revenge was pretty bad. Like when they captured Bulbasaur and Charmander and planned it to kill them and dismember them. I mean, kill Charmander use his body parts as uh, clothing and force Bulbasaur to be stuck in captivity so they can <coughs> quote unquote feed on his succulent bulb for generations to come. Mm. Yeah, that was another one of their weirder moments. But in the context of the story, they're just trying to get revenge for what Charmander did. Even though Charmander is the main protagonist, he is technically the antagonist at the same time. I mean, if someone murdered your brother, you would want to get revenge too, right? And it, even if the Caterpies, you even if you would consider them the villains in the context of the story, think about it. The Geodude is just basically their slave. So is Rock Smasher a villain song? Well, that's up to you. Anyways, for now, I'm Melan, and peace out.